Hey you right guys, Trish Mutters Joe here and today we are watching and reacting to episode 6 of The Witcher Season 3. It's been a month since we got part 1, we have 3 episodes now to conclude Season 3. How's your month been? I hope it's been well, it's uh, gone very very quickly I feel. Um, it feels like 2 weeks ago maybe that we were doing part 1 of this show but uh, yeah we ended on... I mean, I guess I thought the show was a cliffhanger. I thought the episode five was fine. Um, I think there, are, like I say, some good parts of season three. There's still some of that season one and season two stink that is kind of carried through with it. Like I do, like I said in the part one, I find some of the politics kind of bland. I find some of the side characters a bit boring. Uh, but the best parts about it are like Geralt, Ciri, and Yennefer, and they have been really, really good this season. So hopefully we can just get more of that going forward. But I know we're going to get a lot more of the politics stuff as well, which, like I say, it's fine. I don't think it's the worst thing, but it's kind of bland. Like, I get what they're trying to do, but it's like, okay. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm going to probably film all three episodes today, and then but I'll do upload one a day. So uh, at six today, and then we'll do... What day is it even today? Thursday, so Friday, Saturday, we'll get it done by. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoy, make sure to leave a like if you're new. Make sure to subscribe as we have this time next week. We have Heartstopper Season 2, so I'll be doing all of those, of course. And yeah, let's do this. Oh, that Should epic aside, cliffhanger. A new day dawns, Carol de Riviera. I cannot let you leave until we've done this. <laughs> Everyone get bullied. So I'm a prisoner. We're only here for mages. Holding you is more of a courtesy. Just kill him, because he's going to wreck you all now. Piece of advice, though. Coming after mages in their own home during a conclave. That's suicide. Mm. Yeah, well. <laughs> yeah, they'll all be dead by the end of season three, I'm sure. Traitors to the Brotherhood. You'll get what you deserve. Oh, there she is again. She's going to get executed, I'm sure. Why would they have not taken Geralt's sword? Or why would they have just left it on the desk? <laughs> you don't hear the wall. Okay. Siri. Uh, Siri wasn't even in episode 5, so she's missed quite a bit. Or the part where you tried to kidnap a young woman under my care whilst I slept. Well, you... Would make everything easier for us. Oh, he is actually trying to do that. Because that is who you are, Adavend, at your core. How do you know that? You spoke like three times. Let's not get it twisted. <laughs> I think they're making out that these two have had like a three season arc or something. That's who you are. I thought you were different. I've seen the good in you. <laughs> the, the two conversations you've had. Sarah's off, she's gonna get shit done. Are they all traitors? No. Just Vilgefortz and his cronies. The rest cronies. shall bear witness. What are in Gotham? And why are they bound in Demaretium? Our protection. Oh, does it stop him using magic? The Brotherhood needs our help to root out these traitorous infestations. So this is a trial? No. A purge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good luck. Fight all you want. The lion cut will won't be one. Oh yeah. That code book foots. Devil snare. <laughs> oh, they're right. I was hoping Istrid and the others had made it down here. The makeup for that's so good. I need a I need a closer look. Unless it's CGI, it might be a mix of to. Siri will find and fulfill her own destiny. Her destiny is with Vilgefortz. Her blood. I think it's a mess. Oh. Nothing. Yeah, Yennefer kind of got bullied there a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I've shrouded your little kingdom in a powerful binding spell. Oh yes, I can feel right. it. I was gonna say, <laughs> could they just all do a spell and everyone would blow up? I assume they'd uh, stopped them doing that. Bad gambit to put all mages in the service of Vizimir. Strike him, you will not live to see sunset. There's no need. Oh, it's all sunset. Make it. <laughs> There's an unnatural fog in the bay. What do you mean? Someone's using magic to conceal ships. Don't you see? It's Why a Rodanian you tell armor. That? Here to oh, support okay. their treachery. You might be coming to save the day. You never know. Oh, three ships. Well. So... Oh, never mind. Bilgerforce will be exposed today. She spurned you for what you had to do at Sodden Hill. Whoever they are. 
Sodden Hill. I hate that place. Shut him up. Oh. She warned you. Oh, that was so easy. Oh my god. Death to Redania. You didn't think of that, you lot of amateurs. You're too late. They broke us so easily. Let's go over to that. Oh, there we go. Cool. That might be the easiest prison escape ever. I'll just tell you where we've taken her. You really trying to one v one, Geralt? Was... <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> I was gonna say, there's no way he has a chance. I've got fifty men coming on those boats. Fifty. One of them's a barber surgeon. So embarrassing. <laughs> They were prisoners for, let me just check, um, literally nine minutes. <laughs> oh my god, Majors is sick. I'm finished here. Don't ever come back here. Oh, kill her! She's obviously gonna be a nuisance. Oh, uh, don't, don't. A lot of these guys are rolling up. I mean, they do look kind of badass, to be fair, I'm not gonna lie. Why? This is our home. No, to say her. This is your home. I don't care who sacks it. Okay. I have my own aims, and they no longer include you. Now they're being a traitor. With your undying trust, we're easy to fall. Okay. Well, we can kill this guy then. He was boring anyway. Wilkefort, please. Please do not do this. Hey, what? Well, he wasn't too bad, to be fair. Just stop him. What are you. Just go over to him and knock him out. Oh no, it's too late. Let him open it. Poor Tessaia. Such a failure of judgment. And just walks off. <laughs> uh. Hell yeah. Squad. Oh, it's just these losers. Never mind. They look so much more badass when it didn't reveal who they were. I mean, I, mean, I should have picked up on the name, I guess, but... <laughs> Choose her as our own, and we bring the Elder Blood Princess home. These lot of shit, just use your mage spell and burn them all. Or get Geralt to 1v1 him. Oh, Geralt is Surely the mage is, like, solo this easy. <laughs> oh, no. Here we go, let's see what they got, I guess. Oh, they got like no! magic arrows. Oh, okay. Never mind. Oh, Jesus. Do some spells, bro. There we go. Yo, they took their time. Yo, I wonder. I hate when she was just cut away from the good stuff. <laughs> I want to make it last a whole lap, I'm sure. <laughs> the one with the back doing that is. <laughs> oh, get bullied. Okay, the mage is actually kind of embarrassing, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, that guy. <laughs> Just do that again, just keep throwing them everywhere. That was OP. Oh, she's given up. <laughs> That's all she had to do. <laughs> Throw an imploding bomb spell. That's hilarious. No, never mind. Uh, they're both terrible, both these teams are. Oh, uh, this shit character as well. He's just been drunk for half the bloody show. <laughs> oh, this guy's solo in. Oh no, everyone's stopping. It's like, oh guys, stop. The doors are closing. <laughs> uh. Look at this boss. Oh, she's bringing it down. Oh. Jesus. Uh, 
has before. <laughs> We're almost at the stables. Or not. Is that his Siri go over there? <laughs> Oh my god, bro. <laughs> you won't kill her, your master wants her alive. I have no master. <laughs> she just chopped his fingers off. I'm going to remove my sword. I mean, you could just re heal him, I'm sure. Back away. Mate. <laughs> oh, I'm sick. I don't even care. <laughs> that guy was the worst mate. He always rolled on up and got absolutely embarrassed. He just looked cool. Great episode so far. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Our powers combined! It's Power Rangers! How does that help? That's worse! <laughs> Oh, it's so much fun, I really care. <laughs> this is what we needed more of, shit like this. <laughs> I love that they joined swords but had to still hold on to it. <laughs> oh, the mages are so embarrassing. Let's go. He's a heart of course, he bloody is. <laughs> If you're ever gonna have a hard attack, I guess now will be the time. My heart! No, this character. Let us fight with you. For you. Okay. Off with you pop, me. I guess. They're not going to do much, they're going to walk in there and get shot by some arrows straight away. Why are some of these scenes so comical <laughs> without meaning to me? No, it isn't. We'll keep on fighting. okay, we'll find another way. She's just given up because the random guy died. And well, I guess she found out that her boyfriend was a traitor as well, so. I need you to be okay. Marty, help us! Marty. Thanks, Marty. Oh, no. Oh, Boromir, oh god. How many arrows did that one woman need? I <laughs> think one would have been fine, maybe two. We didn't come this far just to abandon each other. Then don't abandon me. Just go roll up with I her. I have to do this. Geralt could solo everyone there, so it'd be fine. <laughs> Destiny brought us together. They've we rushed this mother-daughter bond. Don't. Which is so annoying, because I felt like this could have been we a... Because they... I love you, my daughter, like shit like that. It's... Uh, it that, like, it would have been a great moment, and I would have felt it, but... Keep in mind, these two have only really got to know each other this season. <laughs> I've not I've not had that feeling of them being mother and daughter at all. I'd want, I'd want to, but it's just it's so rushed, which is unfortunate. I love you, my daughter. Okay. Yo, he's still fighting these two. There we go. You've been fighting for like 50 minutes. No! He's gonna kill her in it. Okay, no Yo, imagine that hitting your head. I kind of wish I saw that. CGI is good on her. I mean, it made sense considering the budget. Some looks a bit dodged, but. I like that. I like that. <laughs> Look, it's like Merlin. That's <laughs> a bit OP. That's a rave. <laughs> well, that's it. They've, they've won now. I kind of wish you didn't do that because I was enjoy enjoying the battle. Thank you for the book. But it's not the only thing I want. I'll oh. see you soon. Okay, never mind. <laughs> this guy was broken, mate. All alone now, are we? He's gonna stab you in the face, mate. Oh, mm. yeah. oh, okay. What do you call a spy master when all of his spies have fled? Go on. Hmm? Just a master? The answer is dead. Uh, that was. 
that was embarrassing. They're, they're the final lines he went out with before death, by the way. Keep that in mind. He's going to hell just for that line of dialogue. Fort Al played us. We must move. Oh, oh what a shot. Definitely just killed her then. <laughs> it will only one. Can you cast the portal? No. Not until we get some distance from Tor Lara. Good thing you enjoy pain. Yeah, but I don't know about that kind of pain. We need to get down there. Jump. You take full damage, or how is this guy just rolled up to the field where they are? <laughs> Some things are very convenient. To my family, he killed. He's haunted my nightmares ever since. <laughs> but I'm not afraid of him anymore. All right, Siri versus this guy. Let's go. Carol just standing aside. Like, yeah, sure. I've dreamt of this moment. Well, Sue's not going to die or get taken, is she? So. <laughs> I love Geralt watching. Oh, he's going to... Oh, no, she's going to boot him off the cliff. I do not wish to fight you. Oh, Pick it up! She's going to kick him off. My life is yours. Hey, she could have a, an extra bodyguard. I owe you that. I don't see his arm just ending here. Oh. Let's go, you tell. Go. Okay, never mind. He's <laughs> like, never mind. <laughs> I should scratch everything about that. Sorry. <laughs> it just runs off. Oh, so... You're alright, John Snow. <laughs> it's B Tech John Snow. <laughs> oh, some seas look so amateur. I love it. B Tech John Snow. Yo, she's gone. Well, not quite great, but. Bloody hell, Darth Sidious. Hell yeah, Final Fantasy, let's go. Stand back or die. Or die. <laughs> Oh dear, I'll be all right. He's tapping into fire magic! No shit. What do you mean he's tapping into fire magic? Obviously. Oh. <laughs> oh. Falcon will be waiting for you. That's fire in both of his hands. I think he's using fire magic. Oh, okay. Oh, that's fine. So, we oh, have yeah. an epilogue then. Oh, this guy. This guy's going to get wrecked. Well, maybe not. The denouement that draws the plague to a close. You're a wise man, Geralt. A lot like me. <laughs> a warrior touched by magic. Alone in a world he never A 3D made. effect. Enough with your parallels. It is you who is the enemy of good today, Geralt. I grow tired of yeah. asking. And I grow tired of answering. Arrogance will be your undoing. Let's go. And steel will be yours. <laughs> it's, a, it's a good combat. But the combat is so much better in this season. Uh, you don't want that hit you in the face. Today I hold back no more. Oh mate, stop talking. Oh, Carol, come on, bro. <laughs> Bloody hell, she's worse for her. Die, abomination! <laughs> uh, <laughs> she's got like perfect white hair still. <laughs> I thought this guy was absolutely going to get destroyed, and I was a bit wrong. Wow. How did that go through? It's blunt, isn't it? 
Make a friend of this pain, Geralt of Rivia. Today. Jesus. You begin your new life. As my warning to the continent! Uh, oh, wow. Okay. This is supposed That's to be. That's not lesson. great, Geralt. Jesus. That's his spine done in. Geralt's gotta use a wheelchair for the rest of the season. I shall see you later. One day. Right, perhaps. you let him go, I guess. Well, he got absolutely destroyed, to be fair. I feel like that's the first time he's actually had a bit of trouble in a fight. <laughs> Be what are you break. doing? You don't know what you're playing with, Cirilla. You are not ready for this kind of power. Yeah, we'll see. Should be fine, I'm sure. But together, we can change this continent. <laughs> okay, or not. How are you in the water? I guess it would have. Yeah. <laughs> Tides rise. Is this how uh, Henry Cavill leaves the show? I wonder actually why, what they do to have him leave. Story-wise. So I still don't know if it's like... Hemsworth is coming to play a different Witcher. Which I assume is the case. Or just replacing Geralt. Yeah, and... Uh... Pretty good uh, reintroduction back to season three, I guess, in terms of going for... Geralt's on his motorbike outside. But uh, yeah, the, it still has some of the kind of Witcher... I don't know, some things always feel a little bit off about it. Like, some of this just kind of came across as comical. Like, some of the dialogue's delivery is just bad sometimes. Uh, and there are, like, other things going on. But I will say... All that aside, this was a really fun episode. Uh, I had fun with it. I feel like though this should have been... I think given... <sighs> under better writers, better directors, like a better crew for this show, I feel like this would have been like a 9 out of 10, 8 out of 10 kind of episode. Um, but it's just like, say, some of it just feels a little bit off still. And I, I think this was a good episode. I'd go like a mid-7, I think like 7.5 out of 10. But... It's just like certain scenes feel rushed and a bit beaten. Like that guy being doing his big speech about how Siri should kill him. Then like some knights roll up and he's like, actually no man, runs off and then he's there with his sword and then he just cuts and we don't see him. It's just like, come across. it comes across as funny like <laughs> a lot of the time. What do you call a spy master when all his spies are gone? Dead. Oh, <laughs> it's like, okay, this is the dialogue we're doing, I guess. Um... So, but but if you just go into this episode trying to have fun, I feel like it's one of those, and I hate I hate doing this, so that's why I'm kind of not giving it an eight or nine out of ten. But you have to turn your brain off with this episode and just have fun with it, because uh, I think if you start looking into all the little details of like even some of the choreography, it just comes across as like when I mean, those two guys join swords and we're still <laughs> it's like how is that guy still fighting them after twenty minutes? It should have gotten absolutely wrecked. I'm sure there's some deep meaning as to why they did that. But for me, it just comes across as silly. Um, but again, <laughs> really fun episode. So I'm a bit conflicted by it. Uh, I think I'll go a 7.5 out of 10 though. Because, you know, I guess I don't, sadly, I don't really come to Witcher for the incredible dialogue or the interesting politics or even the exhilarating storyline. Like, to be honest, it doesn't really have any of that. It's like the reason I'm still sticking around this long is because the characters are entertaining and when it does scenes and episodes like this they are fun to watch. Um, so yeah, I, I'll go a 7.5 out of 10. Um, but this really should have been like a 9 or something. Like I felt like they really put a lot into this episode and it just kind of came across as a bit, like say, a bit amateurish <laughs> at times. Um, but yeah, I'm sounding probably a bit too harsh on it, but hopefully you guys get what I mean. But thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to jump straight into episode 7, so I'll see you for then. Until then, take care. Peace.